Hi everyone, my name is Mike from Rome Chido and this video is going to be taking a look at the modifications toward the full dual back position and ways to build up strength in the Ashtanga Vinyasa Yoga practice. So I'm going to explain each version starting from the easiest leading up to more difficult uh, variation. So here is the first modification. So with this version of the pickup, the first thing um, I'm trying to work towards is the correct hand placement, so taking the hands in front of the hips, and then from there really pressing the palms down onto the mat, keeping the arms as straight as possible, bringing the knees right in towards the shoulders, right in, drawing the belly in, and then inhaling and begin up for at least two breaths. One, two. So that way we get a sustained amount of weight onto the shoulders and onto the wrists, which will really help you to build up strength. So this version is really good for beginners. People are, are brand new to the practice and just working towards building a basic foundation of strength. Okay, so this is the second version. Okay, so on this variation, again, still on the same point, so hands in front of the hips, knees drawn right in towards the shoulders, drawing the belly in. Only this time, rather than resting the feet on the floor, I'm picking the whole body weight up. So all on an inhalation. And again, that's for two counts. One, two. So again, so you're learning to have a sustained amount of uh, work on the shoulders, but also the hip flexors as well, to really bring the knees right in towards the chest. So that's the intermediate phase. And the final version, or the final variation, so on this final version to our building strength toward the jump back, as you can see this time. Extra element that was added was trying to take the head right down towards the mat. That's really important because when you take the head down, the hips go up, and that's what that's what's going to help you to actually try and take the feet in between the hands. And it's very important when you do this that you're constantly pressing your hands down to the floor. You never let the actual uh, pressing action stop. So you're always pressing down to the floor all the time. So head down, allow the hips to go up. And then kind of just relaxing the feet down onto the floor. Once you can do that third uh, version, you're pretty much nearly there to achieving the full uh, jump back position. So there are just various ways that you can build up strength uh, toward the full jump pad position in Ashtanga Vinyasa Yoga. And thank you very much for watching. Hope you found this helpful. Namaste.